We're here at the airstrip in Tanzania and we're getting ready to pop on a an hour 15 minute flight to Kigali, Rwanda. Rwanda yes. style. Yeah. yeah. True. Uh -oh. In the van. Getting ready to go to our hotel for the night. We're heading to our hotel for the one night we are in Kigali, which is the four points at Sheridan, and then as you are next to the destination here in Rwanda. just had some breakfast and now we're gonna be heading to our first destination here in Rwanda on a two and a half hour drive it is to the one and only gorilla's nest We're now heading to a women's center where they create cloth from different animals found in Rwanda. We're super excited to see it all and get to learn from these women what they make. And here is a little room tour for you all. We were staying in a two bedroom villa, me and Sophie. So this is the first bedroom where I slept for the next three nights. Little desk area back there, as well as the front door and a little pantry area for some snacks and drinks up here. Also a coffee maker, we don't drink coffee, and then the fridge underneath. Here's a more aerial view of the room and a nice TV, as well as a fire pit underneath. Here's our closet area, got to hang up our clothes, also had free laundry services where me and Sophie put our stuff, Sophie's closet, and here's our beautiful bathroom. It came with a beautiful tub overlooking the beautiful property, 
two sinks. And here's our toilet. Our shower is right here. And now for the second bedroom where Sophie slept, had a TV as well, plus a half bath. There's the sink. And here is our beautiful outdoor area. Nice little couch space we got to sit outside. And our beautiful scenic views. And yeah, that's your little room tour. We just got back to the hotel from visiting the Hand Spun Hope. It was so amazing to see the process and just meeting all these different women. Totally cool. And yeah, so we're back at the hotel getting ready to head out. And this will be our itinerary for the next few hours. So we're gonna watch a traditional dance by the Boma and then have a little briefing before we visit the gorillas tomorrow. Super excited, early morning trip. And then we have dinner at the Jack Hanna. Currently, on the golf cart, they also call them buggies. Dad's in the back with me, Mom's over in the front. I feel like we're on Ferrari Safari. So it's currently 6 a.m. And we're getting ready to go on our gorilla trip game. We're in the car getting ready for a 30 minute drive to our starting point to see the mountain gorillas and see some silverback gorillas. So we're super excited. There are 23 families of these gorillas in the park and there are over 1,000 and growing gorillas in this park. Me. Oh, sorry. I was just fell oh. and broke my head. Sorry. Hey, we're in the park. Jungle. We made Did it. we make we it? Did. Is this it? Yes, yeah, it's good as any as you look good as any. Yeah, yeah.
made it. <laughs> out of the thick of it. Out of the thick of it. Out of the thick of it. <laughs> what are they called? Pals. I ice skate armor? Yeah, Pals. they look like leg warmers. That's not a And we made it back to the hotel. That was a very long journey, but we all survived. And yeah, heading to lunch now. A little late lunch, but lunch nonetheless. So we've currently been resting in the room for the past like two hours because we did do like a seven hour trek to see those beautiful silverback gorilla and gorillas today. So we're getting ready to go to dinner. Tonight is our last night here at the one and only Gorilla's Nest. And tomorrow afternoon, we're going to our next location. So we're now in the car heading to the Ellen DeGeneres campus of yeah. the Diane Fossey Gorilla Fund. Then, then we'll picture right here because we saw it yesterday. Then, 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 and yeah, we're gonna explore a bit and then head to our next location. was our time at the Ellen DeGeneres campus for the Diane Fossey Foundation. It was truly amazing and just being able to have an interactive experience. On that note, however, this concludes the vlog for our first part of being here in the beautiful country of Rwanda. So I hope you all enjoy the vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next adventure. Mm -hmm.